this is another question related to the translation it is november 2009 paper 1 question number 25 what it is going to say the grid above show the point p having coordinates 1 2 1 2 yes it is p and q is minus 7 4 minus 7 and 4 yes p can be mapped on to q so p can be mapped p is the object and q is our image by translation it is mapped by translation write down the column vector column vector or translation vector how much it is shifted under the translation we have to find this so p is our object so we have to move in the in the negative x direction to get the coordinate of q so minus 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so it is it will be minus 8 in the x direction and 1 2 in the y direction so we get minus 8 and 2 will be the translation factor of of translation okay this is another question of past paper it is november 2010 paper 2 question number 10 we are going to solve all the questions related to the translation okay so what the question is the diagram shows triangle a and triangle b okay a translation t maps on maps triangle a on to b so a will be our object and b will be our image okay it is mapped triangle a mapped on to triangle b state the column vector representing this translation column vector means translation factor we have to find the translation factor so if we label this as the triangle as a b and c and the corresponding vertices will be a dash b dash and c dash so how much this triangle a is shifted in the x direction and y direction to get the the image of it will be as triangle b so if we take a and then count in the x direction to get the corresponding vertex then 1 2 in the x direction 2 in the x direction and 1 2 3 in the y direction so this will be the translation factor or the column vector column vector 2 and 3 in order to recheck another we take the another vertex uh, another vertices of uh, object and image and then count it to get the corresponding vertex of uh, image then 1 2 in the x direction and 1 2 3 in the y direction all will be the, in the positive direction because positive values because we are go, we are moving uh, towards right in the x direction so it will be positive 2 and in the upward direction it will be also in the and moving up is also in the positive direction so 2 and 3 will be our column vector column vector in order to check another vertex Uh, c and c dash then 1 2 in the x direction and 1 2 3 in the y, y direction so the column vector will be 2 and 3 it is quite a straight forward we can check this translation as a and b in the as the same size same shape and same orientation okay this is another question related to the translation which is June 2012 paper 1 question number 13 what it is going to ask 
it is write down the vec the vector that represents the translation that maps triangle a onto b triangle a will be our object and triangle b is our image okay so the it is also given that translation the type of transfer transformation is translation and we have to find the vector translation vector or translation translation factor so the thing is that we just uh, label it label the object as a b and c all the vertices are labeled and the corresponding vertices will be a dash b dash c dash okay so if we take a and to get the corresponding vertex of uh, image as a dash so how will i get this uh, a to a dash if we move x in the x direction as 1 2 in the x direction in the x direction the movement is 2 and in the y direction we have to move downwards so 1 2 3 4 in the y direction and since it is in the y direction uh, in the downward direction so the uh, y will be in minus 4 so the translation factor will be 2 and minus 4 in order to recheck another vertex can be taken as b and b dash and then we count this in the x direction so 1 and 2 in the x direction and in the y direction we have to move downward 1 2 3 4 in the y direction so uh, same translation factor will be here so 2 and minus 4 is a translation factor and or the column vector so this is our answer okay so if you have any question then please ask me in the comment section thank you very much another question November 2012 paper 1 2 question number 22 the question says that the diagram shows triangle ABC. The triangle ABC is translated by 9 2 onto triangle A dash B dash C dash. Find the coordinates of C dash. Here object ABC is given and the translation factor or the column vector 9 2 is also given. With the help of column vector, we can find the coordinates of C dash, which is the image of coordinate C. We can use the formula I is equal to O plus T, where I is the image, O is the object and T is the translation factor. Here image is C dash and object is C and translation factor is T. So I is equal to 2 1 plus 9 2 so adding these quantities 2 plus 9 1 plus 2 is equal to 11 3 therefore c dash is equal to 11 3 so the coordinates of c dash is equal to 11 comma 3 it is also noted that there is no grid of small squares are given or shown in the question paper. Otherwise, with the help of translation factor 92, we can directly move 9 units on x-axis and 2 units on y-axis upward to get the coordinate of C dash, which is equal to 11.3. Okay, so our answer is C dash is equal to 11.3. Okay, so if you have any question, then please ask me in the comment section. I will respond to you. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, the question 
is uh, June 2014, paper 1 to question number 17. What is the question asking? The diagram shows the triangle A, B and C. Okay, A, B and C are three triangles are given. Triangle A can be mapped. A can be mapped onto triangle B by a translation. Trans the type of transformation is given and write down the column vector for the translation. We have to find the column vector that how much the object is shifted uh, to form the image. It is object and it is image. So if we label this triangle a as a b and c and we get the corresponding vertices by counting uh, by moving in the x direction and in the y direction to get the translation factor or the column vector okay so a dash p dash and c dash so if we move from a to a dash then in, in x direction how much I move 1 2 3 in x direction I have to move 3 blocks and in the y direction only one okay only one block and in the x direction it is three blocks so the translation vector or the column vector will be 3 and 3 and 1 so in order to recheck another vertices another vertex a and b and b dash should can be taken so if we move in the x direction then 1 2 and 3 to get the b b dash in x direction it is 3 and in the y direction it is only 1 so 3 and 1 will be a translation factor okay so if you have any problem or uh, question then please ask me in the comment section thank you very much